So the second round of the FIA Formula 3 European Championship is here at the Hungara Ring near Budapest. Mick Schumacher will go from P4. The pole sitter, though, is Daniel Tigton. And at the start of the race, Marcus Armstrong, with a very good start, moves from P5 to within the top, but after a few metres, really struggles with his car and is passed. Alex Paolo, with a bad start, loses many positions. Daniel Tictum takes over the lead once again, followed by Ralph Aron, P2, and Guan Yu Zhu is P3. However, Ralph Aron, a judge to have made a jump start, will get a five-second time penalty. Now, the fight for P5 in the race is between Mick Schumacher and Jury Vips, so Prima Theodore Racing versus Motopark. Mick Schumacher will remain ahead of the Estonian racer, though, and at the finish, Daniel Tictum will take the win. Now, followed on track by Ralph Aron, but because of the five-second time penalty, he'll fall back to P5, elevating Guan Yu Zhu and also Robert Schwartzman into the podium places. Confirmation of the top ten on screen for you. Tictum, Zhu and Schwartzman, the drivers that we will see celebrating on the podium, and there they are with the champagne spraying here at the Hungara Ring. Not long to wait before race number two. We just await the lights out and then the start of the race. And as the engine note rises and the cars get away, Jury Vips with a very bad start. Basically, he stalls his engine, moved a bit, then stalled, getting a five-second time penalty because he actually moved before the lights went out and therefore a jump start. Daniel Tictum loses uh, two positions. The man on the charge really is Enem Ahmed, the uh, rookie driver, but here you can see more problems for uh, Daniel Tictum, and unfortunately this would be a race-ending moment for Daniel Tictum with a component failure. He has to walk away from the car and retire. Now, after 13 minutes of the race, Enem Ahmed leading, followed by Marcus Armstrong and uh, Alex Paolo for high-tech uh, Bullfrog GP. Uh, Mick Schumacher is uh, running in P7 at the moment, and. There are plenty of Mick Schumacher fans here, as you can see. At the finish, the rookie driver, Enem Ahmed for high-tech Bullfrog GP, wins. And Marcus Armstrong takes P2, and P3 goes to Alex Paolo. Confirmation of the top ten on screen for you. And what celebration from Enem Ahmed! Look at this jump! It was a bit of a bad landing, but the jump was actually superb. So delighted with that win, and sharing the success, of course, with the high-tech Bullfrog GP team. Race number three then here at the Hungara Ring gets underway with a lights out and Gian Daravala, P4 with a very bad start. Stores the engine but does get going but loses many positions. Now Daniel Tictum with a good start takes over the lead but very much like in race one, the contact with... Uh, Marcus Armstrong, unfortunately, will mean that Marcus Armstrong has to retire from the race. And full course yellow, as you can see, and Marcus Armstrong sadly out of the race. However, another stunning drive and display from Enem Ahmed, the uh, uh, rookie driver, is leading the race, followed by Daniel Tickton, P2, and Mick Schumacher, P3. Now, bear in mind, Mick Schumacher started from P9. This is Gian Daruvala following the start. He's got the bit between his teeth and passes uh, Kevin Suri Andres, and this is for P12. Enem Ahmed then wins the race, followed by Daniel Tictum and Mick Schumacher for P3. Confirmation of the top 10 on screen for you. Two outstanding drives from Enem Ahmed in a very good points haul as well as he uh, celebrates in Park Ferme in a slightly more reserved fashion than he did after his uh, win in race two. Here, confirmation of the Drivers' Championship with Enem Ahmed on 83 points, Gwen Yu Siu on 65, and Daniel Tictum. B3 on 63 points as the drivers celebrate on the podium. We head from the Hungara Ring to the street circuit at Norris Ring next.